It's Street Talk with Loretta Rose, and on today, we have a small business highlight for you. Someone in the community reached out to me and told me I need to highlight this small business owner. Stick around because everybody needs a handyman. On today's show, we got a handyman right here from our community. It's Street Talk with Loretta Rose, and you're watching here on Bull TV. Loretta Rose, and on today's show, we're giving you a small business highlight with Street Talk. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How you doing? I'm wonderful, and I would like to say welcome to the show, Sam McEntee. Thank you for having me. Absolutely, everybody need a handy man. Hey, I agree. And I heard that I need to interview you because you are a prominent handyman right here in our Tri City community. That's great. Tell us the name of your business. Big Trust Mountain Service. Um, I like to say a business for the people. Oh, I've I want to appear like that. A business for the people because if you can't rely on this guy, then you call me. I'm always comfortable. Okay, okay. I like that. All right. So, Mint Trust Mountain in Service. What's significant about Mint Trust? Because that's very unique. Well, like everybody always asks me, where did the name come from? Why? Um, my wife, I'm about to give you a shout out to my wife. She was like, why don't you take the first two letters of your last name and put on the end of trust, but don't put a T, put two S. One for strong support. Oh. So we want to bring trust back into small businesses, black owned businesses. And I love it. You know, hey, okay. we, don't, we don't discriminate with race. Wow, I love it, I love it. Shout out to your wife. You'll help me. <laughs> she helped you on that one. I love it. So Samuel McEntee is your name, Junior. Yes. Wow, how did you land in this industry? Honestly, I want to say it's kind of like a bloodline thing, but it's really a passion. I mean, I grew up around seeing my dad work, my granddad. Of course, you know, he had mom blown out of the hammer and use a drill, but you know, God rest they soul, they all gone now, but that's why I'm like going so hard with it because wow. it's like a bloodline thing, but it's like I said, it's a passion. It's something that I, I desire to do. I want to help people. It has its days, yeah. but it's a passion. That's anything that's a passion gonna have its days. And anytime you can help people save money, you help them. Definitely. <laughs> well, there's someone in the community that reached out to me and she was just talking on how wonderful you have done work at her home. And she wanted to share you with the community. And so I said, well, let's see how we can make that happen. And she had asked, did I have small businesses on? And I said, you know, it's been a while. So let's see how we can make this happen because everybody need a handyman, yeah. especially if you're a homeowner, always something going on. So help us to know some of the various services that you provide with your handyman service. So for all the ones that know, I do offer basic handyman service so when i said basic handyman that's like say for example um we all know i do tv mounting tv mounting doesn't fall under that so basic handyman would be like you might need a door put up or you might need window re you know replacements mm -hmm. uh ceiling fan oh anything you name it like anything that's under that but tv mounting all that that's all their own category wow wow and i saw that where you have Mattress Mountain and Service. So the mountain is, you know, TVs and things is how yes. you originally started. Yes. And in what year? How long you been in business? 2019, been in business wow. five years. Oh, wow. Five years. It seemed like it just only been one good year because when I first started, I didn't I didn't have a truck always. I didn't have like, what, three trucks? I, I ain't had, I worked out of a car. Okay. Truck of a car. Small beginnings. Mm -hmm. And that's how most of us small business owner, that's how we start. Yes. So you are not from this area. So how did you end up here in the Tri-City area? Because you all live here now. Well, you know, I feel like maybe God brought us this way. Yes. And it probably was to, you know, my business to serve this community. I don't know how long God won't, but I'm whatever, how, how yes. long he said. 
I mean, you were right. like Absolutely. Merit, family man, and um, small business right here in our local community. So I was looking at some of your information that you have. You do security, home, and business camera installation. Yes. Okay. All right. I, I may be calling you on yeah. that. I heard that um, you provide for home and businesses. Mm -hmm. Furniture assembly. I was looking at some images. Oh, that's the strong one. I love it. it. People hate it. I've had things that took me eight hours, six hours, sometimes even 30, 40 minutes. Oh, wow. But once it's done, everybody's satisfied. I love doing like beds, desks, and whatever you, anything that you call me and say, hey, I need this assembly. No yeah. problem. Wow. No problem. I, I'm glad you mentioned about the bed. I love that princess bed. Tell me about uh, that. Oh, man. That was like, I want to say a little bit before I got, when I got here, I kind of said, she, that, that person that did it was my second client. She actually reached out to me. She said, can you do this? I'm like, yeah, that is no problem. She was like, how long do you think it take you? I said, um, I'm not going to give you an estimate time because I don't want to be wrong, you know, but I turned out, I got through with it in like maybe two hours. Okay. And that princess bed is beautiful. It's like the way it was designed is Two mattresses. Mm -hmm. It's kind of coming like Beautiful. it's built like a house. I like, love it. And the little girls in like in between, they got they both share a table. So oh sweet, I love it. I love it. Princess bed, I love it. Of, of course, the TV mountain doorknob replacement. I saw that some images about that. So yeah, now that there, that that's not your regular doorknob. That's not your you know exterior doorknob. I have people on. The keypads, oh. program, you know, like they like to put the keypad in where you can put the code. Yes. Order. Those were a challenge to me, but over the time, I like, you know, I gained myself knowledge. I gained knowledge on how to do them. I just, you know, took time. To, I like, love it. It's a trial and error in this industry. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't understand. You can't give up when you don't do right. You might cut some the wrong size. Gotta go back and do it again. That's right. That's right. I love it. That's some good information from a business owner. Who do you credit that has in encouraged you for these last five years, almost six years into business? Because when business, when you launch a business, you never know how it's going to, you know, unfold. And it is such a blessing to have people that right there cheering you on and encouraging you, even though when it business don't look real good at that time i said at that time doesn't mean it's always going to be like that it has its seasons but what kept you motivated honestly i gotta give god all the things because mm -hmm. you know i, I didn't been through some tough times but i want to say god my mother of course my wife yes you know I, I, only reason i know it's supposed to group, group as god wife mother but both of them women, they was an impact. And plus my sister, my mom's daughter. Those people right there been like, cheer me out. Yeah. It's hard now, like my mom passed last year in Halloween, so all I can do is keep what she told me and said, she, she told me that she said before she passed, she was like, son, you and your sister, you, y'all gonna be successful. She said, your business gonna thrive. And I'll be wow. down, it seemed like her and God working together right now. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I am proud of you. How old are you? I'm 28 years old. I am proud of you, a young business owner. And we definitely want to support you because what I like about you, you have integrity and you have character. And those of you that are inspiring to go into business, that will take you a long way. Yeah. You got to have integrity and character. And don't it's, give up. I'm sorry. That's right. You're right. Tell them. Don't give up. Hey, because I was, I, I've been told my wife many times on the phone, I'm like, I want to hang this up. I do want to retire from it like five years, maybe about the 10 year mark. Cause I want to teach other people that's young how to do this if they're interested in TV mm -hmm. mounting. I see everybody mount TVs, but do they mount it the right way? Mm. Wow. That's the question. Mm. I didn't mount it bricks outside. That's true. Anything like, like what's my slogan? My slogan is call me up and I'm there. But I made another one up with me and my wife joking around. I said, if you need anything mounted, I can mount it. If you want a chair mounted, I can mount a chair. <laughs> I love it. And look, I saw that you would do some automobile services as yes. well. Tire change, oil change, all of that. And plumbing in pipes as well. Man, you are the handy man. I try to be that. I love it. So for those that are watching may want to contact you, first of all, how can we follow you on social media? Um, 
I don't know. If, I don't want to get my person out, but business wise, make trust mounting and services. TikTok, make trust twenty two. Really don't mess with Instagram much no more. Um, if you for for those that's on Next Door, I don't know if you've heard of Next Door. That's an app like neighbor neighborhoods parts of the city keep up with each other. Oh wow! That's how I promote. Next Door is an app for like neighbors, neighbors, oh, wow. people in that city. That's another way I promote. Uh, make trust mounting services on Next Door. N e x t d o o r Next Door and. You just educated me because I didn't know what next door was. I, I'm, I just assumed my next door neighbor. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so, wow, I, I, that's another platform. For those that are not um, on social media or tech savvy, you have a contact number. Yeah. Because we can just call you, right? Yeah, just call me up and I'm there. 269 830 5450. 269 830 5450. Make sure I repeat that again. Awesome. Sam, the handyman with Mac Trust, Mountain, and Service. Well, we want to thank you for sharing your small business with our community, and we wish you much success. Thank you for having me today. You're welcome. You've been watching Straight Talk with Loretta Rose right here on Bean TV. Thanks for watching.